most of us think that it's always got to be behind the pulpit and it's always got to be in words but sometimes your life your life is a testimony the way you live your life before people the way um you go out and tell others you know um sometimes you you don't have to talk but sometimes you show it somebody see the blessings in your life what's up my love bugs and love muffins it's mama love and i'm back with the video <sighs> I just conditioned and did my hair tonight, y'all can't sleep, so I'm up, okay? So I, I just went through it and, you know, I um, blow dried it real, real well and did a little little um, warm press on it and just flat ironed it. And, um, and y'all, I had those little long wispy pieces on there. I took and cut it off. But anyway, I'm doing this makeup thing on my face and, uh, this is concealer, y'all, and I'm just going around like the top part of uh, my uh, lining up my uh, bras or whatever, and uh, I went under it already, and I'm, I concealed it up under here. I usually don't do this, but I'm trying something different. Um, I'm gonna go under here just a little, cause I don't want to cake it like too much. Oh God, where's the other battery? This one about to die. Huh? This battery is about to die. Tina says she found the other one. Where is it? She says she had found it. Oh, that's nice. Now that I'm finna do another video, my wisma call it dies. Anyway, I don't want to do too much. I don't see. Almost like I'm contouring it. Yeah. I don't know. It's a habit. Put those dark spots on your eyes. You gotta always just do a little something different. Anyway. This is NARS. This is NARS. I like NARS because NARS goes on dry like a mat where mat feels like it runs and it's greasy looking but this is this is a matte type of feeling you know so i'm patting it on mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i am so i got so much red in my skin tone mm. all around my nose and everything and i didn't put that primer on that i was showing y'all about cook it also makes my face oily and I don't like the feeling. So I'm just going in here with this. I'm using a uh, powder, uh, pressed powder sponge because it seems to go on better than the actual um, sponge you use the foundation brush. I don't like using it. It seems like it spreads. It's not like it's you know, it's like not not like the right type of paint. You know. Good morning, love bugs and love muffins. My battery died last night. But anyway, I just went and got me a black eyeliner. And um <clears throat> It's by Maybelline or something like that, babe. You want here? Yeah, I'm in here. What? what? I mean, it sound grumpy, but yeah. Katina quieted down her mouth too big. Quiet down. Maybelline, I need a black eyeliner because I got a, uh, I got a, uh, what's gonna call it? A uh, navy blue by Mac. Uh, I'd already applied the uh, concealer uh, to my face. I'm tired, y'all. I can't get a good night's sleep last night, but it's all good. Anyway, I put a concealer on my face already. And uh, foundation as well. NARS is what I was using. Uh, so now I'm going to, where is it at? I think 
I use this one. I'm gonna do these eyes. My eyes are cut. I don't know what you call my eyes. Sometimes they go on a slant base. Sometimes they go on an almond shaped base. I don't know what to call my eyes. Anyway, I'm using my color palettes today. I'm not keeping on this red shirt because I don't know. Red is just not my color, y'all. Red ain't my color. And uh, so what I'm going to do. Uh, this bottom one is called Rolling in Dough. This cream one at the bottom. They got nerd to have names on it, y'all. This is, yeah, Rolling in Dough. Somebody told me to uh, use this as a base. And I'm going to use this as a base. I know. I'm not your uh, trend beat my face. That is one of my uh, love bugs. And I'm one of her supporters as well. Um, Y'all have YouTube channels. Uh, let me know. I will support. Uh, I don't, I'm not the type that, uh, go by oh yeah you have to be up there and all of that and for me to you know subscribe to you because at the time you know we all are trying to get up off the flow you know what i'm saying and who am i i'm not better than nobody else um never felt like that never felt like i was better than anybody that's just the way i am i've always been a, a humble person and how far I know the Lord is gonna take me far though, y'all. And I'm I'm telling y'all, I'm I'm not gonna forget where I came from. I'm not. I desire to go far in the Lord though. That's where I desire to go. That's where my desire is. Go in places and speak what thus said the Lord. Because only what you do for Christ, y'all last. Only what you do for Christ will last. And so I put this rolling in the dough over all the of my eye, the base of my eye. And I don't know what color I'm wearing today. I'm supposing maybe like a, I don't know, it's autumn, it's fall, basically. Um, mm, most of these colors are kind of on the dark side, and I'm kind of scary when it comes to that. Cause I don't want to do nothing too bold. So that's what I'm gonna do. Y'all, I mix up one eyeball at a time as y'all can see. I'm gonna try this classy and sassy. It's like a bronze type of color. And I'm gonna go up in here. I always do the same thing y'all over and over again. I'm gonna go up in this top part and I'm gonna stop halfway in here in my crease. And um, this cocoa truffle, the one I was in you know, sniffing last night, like I, you know, I'm gonna put some of that on. I'm gonna go above it with that. You know, I'm not professional, so don't y'all be talking about me now. I just do enough to get by. Just to get by, just to get by, just to get by. Mm. Anyway, don't make me say that, but anyway. Yeah, um, yeah, anyway, it's just a crease, not too much, y'all, because I don't want people looking at me like, oh, that is too much on her face, and it don't look right. Okay, so that's a little cocoa at the top and the side, the crease here. And I may be doing it wrong, y'all, but bear with me. And then I'm going to take this. Let's go. It's called famous. I'm gonna take this famous and go inside here because that the the cream was just rolling in those. It's just a base, basically. So I'm gonna go up in here. And I seen this girl do it. She did it up in here like an eyeball. Well, actually, it is an eyeball. But what I'm saying is eyelid. Showing up in there. Let's see. That's enough to me. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna take and repeat. Do the other eyeball. Rolling in dough because I already got my concealer on. And I'm gonna cover the whole eyeball or eyelid area. Yeah. 
y'all uh i don't have the type of hair that uh you can just wash blow dry light press put a little gloss on it and go my hair is very uh coarse i have coarse hair and it looks dry to me so i'm gonna end up putting some of that uh what should we call it in it y'all uh uh, what you call it? That uh, olive oil. Okay, so I'm going over here with the classy. No, is that I use that? That yeah, I use that for. And I'm classy but sassy, and I'm going up in here, like I did the other side, and I'm gonna stop right up in the crease area, like I did before. This is a classy but, and this is the cocoa truffle. Like I said, when I be fiending, it's not so good. Just above it. Yeah. I don't like to do too much, y'all. Uh, like I said, I, I plays it safe. So I'll see ya. Okay, so I'm going across the top again with the famous. Like I said, she could put some more than that on. I'm going to make that eye up here. Quit being scared. You're scared? Go to church. I know I do. That's why I go. <laughs> yeah. One up in here. I, I think that's fair. I think it's fair. You know? I think it's fair. So I'm going to stop. All right. So now that I have put that on, I do have this uh, type of like a foundation that I use powder press powder by the Mac by Mac and my color is NC or NW it's NW44 NC44 whatever but it's a that's a press powder that I've already put my uh, makeup on a uh, foundation NARS and I don't like to pile it on y'all so I don't like that caked in type of look you know what I'm saying I like that Girl, look at all that makeup crusted up on her face like that. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like to do that, so. Yeah. I don't know what happened to this part of my head up here. Like, some dry skin had got on it one day. I don't know. Just. And I peeled it. My face was peeling. I'm like, what the heck, man? What's on my face all peeling and stuff? And, uh. Seems like a lot, but it's not, y'all. This is. And uh, that's enough right there. So, yeah. Yeah. Y'all do it uh, till, I, till I'm comfortable. Do it. Come on and do it. Do it. Do it. Satisfied. Mm, do it. Uh, uh, do it. This, y'all. I got this at Ross when I was in Atlanta. When I stayed in Atlanta. And I use this bit every now and then. And it came with the brushes, and this was the brush, but this wasn't. Now, believe it or not, y'all, I may be doing this backwards, but this is the way I do it. Uh, I use the brown for this one because I like to just take this brush and go around. And, uh, you know, I do it like that, you know. And then, uh, I basically go contour around my face, which I don't even know why I put this on because the pigmentation over here is, I don't know, just gives it color because it's not going nowhere. I got to find out about the pigmentation and all that type of stuff. So, and then I blend this all around. I can be like, what the heck is she doing? Something that looked decent enough for me to do? Yeah, no. Anyways, uh, that part really doesn't matter to me, the contour part. Uh, the brown, but the lighting, the uh, the highlight makes a difference to me. When I highlight uh, the areas, hmm, and I usually go in here. It's not. Uh, it's a real light powder. Um, you don't have to. It's not really like strong, like like the you know, but 
like a heavy powder it's like where i keep putting it on like that because you basically just blow it away you know what i'm saying just blow it away just anyways um this is how i make my face up y'all this is this is how i do it um where's that other brush i had here she is and i basically just now i used to put the brown going down each side of my nose but i don't do that anymore i just feel like it, you know just just highlight the area that needs to be highlighted don't, don't be trying to do all extra with the uh it's enough that's enough to me y'all that's enough what do you want you want, what, you want me to what, 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 put on another face that's enough that's enough and so you know um uh, and this is simply what I do. Y'all ain't doing nothing extra because I'm videoing this. But this is actually what I do every day uh, when I put my makeup on. Uh, top liner by Revlon and my magnifying mirror. Uh, like I said, I don't want to get used to the lashes. I used to go ahead and put my lashes on and then do the line. But I'm not putting on lashes, y'all. I'm just going to oh, see me do this. Really thin because I don't want to. Uh, I think I messed up, y'all. I gotta see. I'm trying to go fast in this video because my son be like, dang, huh? This video this long. Uh. That's enough. That's enough. You got the look. You got the look. Remember that song? Y'all might be too young for it. Prince. This it took a whole hour just to make up your face. Baby. That's enough, y'all. That's enough. You ain't got to put all that on there. This is why I say my eyes, they, they're they almond. They look slanted looking. Because every time I go across the lining of my eye, this is the shape that I get because it's the lining. You know, I don't want to go out the shape of the eye. And then I put this mascara on. I got this mascara at Burlington, y'all. But sometimes Burlington's, they got good products, you know. Uh, like I said, I don't want to get used to the lashes, so I'm just going to add this little... I got some lashes on here. It's good enough. Use the ones God gave you sometimes. I like lashes and all, but sometimes, to tell you the truth, and y'all can... Some of y'all uh, that wear lashes can uh, agree to this. But uh, uh, sometimes lashes takes away the shapes of your eyes. And... Uh, I love what God did. You know, I'm just enhancing it. You know, with makeup. But I love the look that God gave me. You know. So I'm going to try this liner out, y'all. I usually try uh, the navy blue. Because I had a kiss liner. This, this. It's pencil kind. And it, um. You know, it bleeds too much. So I'm going to try this one. This is new. Like I said, it's by... Maybelline and uh try it. Okay, so far so good. Uh believe me y'all, uh, I bought a black one before from Mac. Just because it's name brand or Mac or whatever. I don't like Mac, but you know it bled I mean it didn't bleed but it you know it went away. Like I just have to find myself Applying more eyeliner in the middle of the day and my day hasn't got started You know like say for instance, I get dressed in the morning for church or something And then like when I get to church, it was like, you know, I'll go Downstairs check myself out everything make sure everything good and I end up having to apply more That's enough. That's enough. You know what I'm saying? And it's like 
Why am I having to keep applying all this makeup on? I already put this makeup on. I just felt like it should stay on there. You know what I'm saying? All right, so I got a blush brush. Um, I bought. It's really soft. Really soft blush brush I bought because it was too. Uh, gotta hurry up. This video is 17 minutes into this video. This is y'all. This. I don't know, just, just what I do, you know, it's just, they say typical mama makeup. Match on both sides. Y'all, y'all professional makeup artists, y'all probably screaming right now, like, oh my God, oh. Yeah, uh, I'm just gonna use a a light lip gloss. I don't like to brown my lips. Uh, with the brown eyeliner, I I used to do that back in the day, uh, in the '90s and early 2000s. Yeah, so. I think that's decent enough, you know. And um, yeah, that's enough. You know what I'm saying? That's enough. I need all that. My father used to always tell me, "You don't need to wear that makeup. Sometimes let your natural beauty show." And now it's like, I wish I'd have listened to him because now. I feel like I need it, you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, my face look bare. I need to cover this, and this don't look right, you know, this, you know. So what I just grabbed was my olive oil. I'm going to take and put calm um, in my hand, put my hands together, because like I say, my hair. Now, I may lose this bounce once I add this, but so what? Cause I can't stand, it just looks dry to me. You know, it looks dry. And I know why, because my flat arms are not those professional ones where they put that automatic shine in your hair. You know what I'm saying? And I'm gonna get me some, I'm gonna get me some of those. And, uh, and I got this polisher, you know, by Apogee, but to me it doesn't, um, it doesn't do the job of what I need for it to do, you know. And I could go back over my hair with these flat irons, but I have no more time in this video because I, I don't want to make this video too long. But I am going to... Where is my... Video and... Uh, Uh, that goes over there, yeah, and uh, this goes kind of maybe like you know, um, kind of maybe behind the ear type of, yeah, yeah, here, you know, or, yeah. I don't know, I'm not done yet, y'all. I might maybe take some curling irons to it because, like I said, it, it failed, and uh, and uh, yeah. I'm, I'm I'm loving a bob cut, y'all, but I do miss my hair. It grows back though, right? You say after all, it's just hair. And always like a deep side part, um, type of thing. I like to throw it back and it fall forward. But that's after I got that that fresh silk press. You know what I mean? That's when you have a a fresh silk press in your hair, and you gotta learn how to. Style your hair too, you know. To me, this is just one big. Where's my layering? I can't find it. I can't find. I got layering up in this hair like crazy, but I can't find the layering, and then because my hair is so thick, you know what I'm saying. And I'm gonna keep cutting or having them cut in my hair just to find them layers that's in there. But when I get it done at the shop, as y'all could see, y'all saw um, the layering was. There. This is not my best hairstyle, but I was just showing y'all the makeup. Well, I'm getting dressed for the day, and this is how I look.
up. Hope you enjoyed this video. I know this hair is not as a, oh, no, maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I should pull it this way. I don't know. What do you think? Anyway, maybe I should change these little button earrings to some hoops. My day starts. So. Peace out in Jesus' name. Be blessed. Yeah, that's where I'm going. Go ahead and get these done. Be blessed. Mm -hmm.